so I checked. What is that in your hand? Russell sent me a note. Who? Russell. Russell who? Frankie. Russell Frankie from where? Um, two hours away. Two hours away, eight passengers? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, he sent you what? He sent me a letter and I wanted to open it sooner, but boss was on the potty and he didn't want to miss it. So, mm -hmm. I'm just gonna open it. Mm -hmm. It's not even your birthday. Do you know how to open a letter? No. That's okay. Lincoln's just along for the ride. Yep, yep, yep. So tear along there. And then stick your finger in and tear along that back side too. There you go. Yep, just like that. Okay, now pull it out. And we read. Hi, Cody. I heard that you haven't canceled the RV trip or Bear Lake, so that can right. Hi, Cody. I heard that they haven't canceled, canceled the RV trip or the Bear Lake, so that's good. And instead of Trying. Oh, trying to face the time we can write Fletcher's and they and then put more pavers. What is pavers? Mean? More pavers. To have a. And it looks tree. pretty cool. Oh, they're, he's talking about their landscaping in their backyard well, and stuff. To have a tree house in our backyard, it's gonna be fun. See you in a month. Wait, what's in a month? The RV trip? Yep. Yay! Okay, now you're gonna need to sit down and write him a letter back. You guys will be pen pals all summer. Can you just tag along for the ride, okay? You could send Eva a letter. Do you wanna do that? No! Why not? Mm -hmm. But you she'll send you a fun drawing back. Well, I'll give you one guess as to what happened. Mr. Austin got cut. Austin Wade. Oh, flew. Yeah, don't grab his owies. That was intense. You know it's intense if the camera doesn't come out until afterwards. Big old what? scrapes and cuts here. Big old scrapes and cuts here. And then underneath the jeans, there's a few band-aids on his knee. On that one? What one? <gasps> no, I didn't see that. We'll put a band-aid on that one too so your jeans don't rub on it. Oh, that's a good idea. <sighs> Did you cry? <laughs> he squealed like a little pig. All I heard was just the high pitched scream. I, was, I waited for a second to be like, is that a joke or is he really screaming? And it didn't stop, so I ran out. What happened? I fell off my bike. Are you going off the curbs? Mm -hmm. Trying to be a big tough guy no. like your brother? That am big and Like your brother in his wimpy kid hat? <laughs> you know what, bud? That's how I broke my arm. Was going off curbs like that. Mm -hmm. But he fell out of the roof. Shattered my wrist. Boston, I'm gonna see, Cody, I wanna Pretty see. Pretty tough, bud. You okay? Mm -hmm. yeah, you Does it feel okay. better now that I got you bandaged up quite well? Mm -hmm. I was looking all over the place for this bandage stuff. Do you wanna know where it was? On Olivia's dolls. <laughs> It's like, okay, we don't think you kids need this anymore. It's time to go to the real human child. P.S. This is the disaster I created trying to get all the things I needed for Boston's um, wound care. <laughs> I literally will come home and do that later. Dad, where are we going? Well, son, there are two things I've learned in life. Happy wife, happy life. And those are the two things. You need a happy wife and a happy life. And it is Mother's Day coming up, and we ran into a few hiccups with Mother's Day or with quarantine, shipping, priority, everything. Um, it's just impossible. So I'm kind of scheming between me and my parents on how to get Bonnie's Mother's Day present home and uh, safe. And uh, we're working on it right now. So you boys, for all mom knows, we only went to the new house today. We didn't go anywhere else. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Do you understand, boys? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Okay, good. All right. That's the story. For today's, not today's task. But I do have a task here. Bonnie's like, you need measurements for stuff. We are starting to pick out some of the amenities, starting to get some of the design phase going while we've got the drafting done. This is our draft done on this house. It's gonna look really, really cool when we're done. Now we just gotta start laying stuff out. So I need to take a measurement. So we're gonna pretend that this board is the outer wall and we are going to take a measurement 
on here now from further back. 36 inches right there. And actually we'll have to add a half inch for sheetrock. If you guys can just in your head imagine this, shower here, square shower here, and a tub right here, standalone tub right here. So what is that dimension? 32 inches wide. Cody, I need another measuring tape. Go give me that other measuring tape, that green one on top of that wall. Hurry, 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 hurry. 32 inches. Uh-oh. That's where we might run into trouble. We may have to just tilt that a little bit. That. Because it's got to come off that. Ah. Mm. How many, how many, how many, how many, how many, how many? My arms are so tired. Huh? My arms are tired. Your arms are tired? Yeah. Well, buck up, Cody. Now we're going to do this the right way. I was trying to do it with just measurements, and that just was not going to work. Uh, let's see. Let's do it like this. Let's do it like this. Let's do it like this. The shower. Right now, this is my template for the tub. And we need to make sure it fits in here. And I think the only way we can get it to fit is if it sits kind of long wise. Hey, 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 easy. You're messing up on my templates. Now I'm not going to know. Ugh. Okay. Ballpark. <laughs> that will kind of fit. Not as well as I want. I wish it was fitting more square, but it's not gonna fit square in that corner. We can always put this end to end like that, and that's not a bad option. Hmm, I think we need your mother here to decide. Well, scrap all of that. Cody, we're gonna have to wait for mom to come here. Won't she know that we weren't working here that much? Um, we've been working on things that she will find out about on Mother's Day but not until then. Do you understand? Do you understand? What if she sees the video? Mother's Day will have passed by the time she sees this video, so it won't matter, so there we go. But I think we need to have mom's final approval on this for it to really make sense, and I hope she can visually see it. So anyway, we got other tasks to do, let's go. One of the things I'm trying to get done today is Bonnie's Mother's Day present. We already went down and picked up the other half from Grandma and Grandpa. They played their role in getting it for me. They had to go to Salt Lake to get it. I met them in Roy, yada, 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 yada. Anyway, I got the other part of hers. It's not made anywhere. It's something that nobody makes is a white wicker basket for her bike. So I had to buy one and I'm painting it and I hope she likes it. Huh? Are you, are you gonna give her another diamond ring? No, I'm not. No, we are not. You got that corner. There? Okay, hold on. I'll be telling you. Alright, good idea. Oh! oh. oh.